our key success in terms of communication was that we have been something that has not there been before or has been bef there before very long time ago and has been dearly missed by some. So the first thing that differentiates Operation Libero um, from other political um, forces in Switzerland is that it is a movement with, um, which has a lot of advantages. It gives us the possibility to focus on the issues uh, closest to our heart and the issues where we think we can make the greatest difference. Uh, on a content level, what is unique about Libero is that it has the aspiration to truly be liberal uh, meaning liberal in all its aspects. In social issues, where the Liberal Party in Switzerland is not so liberal as we think, um, but also in economic issues. Uh, the goal of Operation Libero is to ensure that Switzerland is a place of opportunity uh, for all living in Switzerland and that it remains so in the future and that Switzerland does not become an open-air museum. I think that we won't become a political party is quite a definitive decision. Uh, we cannot come back on that. Um, and it has a lot to do with the specific situation in Switzerland. In other countries with a different party landscape, it would be a good idea maybe to um, create a political party. I think it has been a good idea in Austria, uh, where the NEOS, with which we collaborate quite closely, um, opted for uh, creating a political party. In Switzerland, the political move um, the political middle is so fragmented, uh, there are so many small parties that it would have been counterproductive to create yet another one. It seemed to be more promising uh, to be visible and uh, dominant in the political language in the hope that our language, our agenda, our imagery will trickle into these political parties and that we gain some influence that way. There are two ways, either you speak to the voters, which requires that you can reach a large audience, or you speak to multiplicators, people who uh, themselves have a large audience and you try to influence them. And as a start, if you're a small movement, it might be wise to invest in that, because then you can target your uh, communication to people who then will communicate on. Um, to be attractive, as a voice for multiplicators, be them uh, politicians themselves or uh, people in the media, uh, I think is that you come up with a new song. You have a new melody, you have new images, you have new topics, you have new values uh, uh, for which you stand. That makes you interesting. And I think our key success in terms of communication was that we have been something that has not there been before or has been bef there before very long time ago and has been dearly missed by some.